shoot him right there. hand coming I back over behind me. I got her behind me. Oh, did you? Yeah, I killed her back You there. see her? Yeah. yeah. You did yeah. get her. Yeah. Well, we did get them off. We killed that one of them. I got way too much gun. You think you need a pickup? <laughs> That's the way to handle that, Jason. That's all we'll handle.
I sure appreciate it. Yo, let me get some of that. Oh, Hold up now. You, you got to pass all the way over. Hey, you had I, I got a string. I can't read I, it. I got to get a, a little bit. I got to get a shot before Jace gets another shot. This here make you do a tap dance too. Yeah, hey, that's a fine. It's a fine brew here. There you go. He'll never give a definite answer. So how many you got? Well, we we, we should have had. Who's that dollar? Yeah. I didn't say what you should have had. What do you have? Well, we we had we had ducks working all over. Yeah, but how many do you have in your possession? Well, I had knocked down two drakes, and a Phil had knocked down the hen. And he said, well, we got six, eight, ten, twelve. Six, eight, ten, twelve. <laughs> like he's playing, you know, even number game or something. <laughs> yeah. He fired a shot. Oh, they're getting a... They said that shoot was in that break. Jimbo? This meal? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, that was that was close. He almost lit right there. Yeah, but we walked him over, Jimbo. We walked the dog. Yep. Get ready, Jimbo, on the left. Kill him. Gumbo out of him. <laughs> Jim, look, Jim and E crickets. <laughs> Sorry about that. What's that? Uh, one I shot, I'm telling you. Yeah. Uh-uh. He He's yeah, tenderized. He have a little foot meat on it. He's tenderized. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking Jimmy Red and Coyote this morning. Look what he did right here. See my air vents, my, my defrosters. He's the one to rig that up. Do it here. <laughs> he he's a local. He's a local. Fix it all. Red, you ready? Huh? Hey, what are y'all doing here? Get your man. Tell him we're going duck hunting. Hey, we can't let work and fish get in the way of a, of a duck hunt, woman. Jimmy, you got plans today? You know, when the man gets after a duck, you got to understand, honey, he just got to go. <laughs> That's it. Take care of the fort till we get back. Hey, Red. That woman, I don't like like she's too fired up about this duck hunt. No, she don't like it too much. Huh? She don't like it too much. <laughs> <laughs> Son, <laughs> you might you you might ought to have one of them back room meetings. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that won't work. Not with that one. <laughs> Come three over here. Stay right there. 
Duct tape. 30 minutes, it's done. <laughs> Pocket knife and a duct tape fix, fix just about anything around. <laughs> Hold your tailpipe on, it'll fix your window when you bust it out. That 100 mile an hour tape is yeah. good, ain't it? Yeah. Patch holes in your waders. Can you fix a rod with duct tape? <laughs> I've seen people try. You know, a redneck without his duct tape, he just lost. No, he ain't got nothing. <laughs> <laughs> yep. They still kill them. Gustav. I mean, think about it. Gustav, he ain't even from around here. He ought to be fooling around over here anyway. Well, now we got old Ike. Ike been around here for years. Well, people say, what do y'all do when a hurricane hits? Well, we go tail hunt. Jeez. We have struck. We've struck.
do it. There, there's no place for a look. That's where it goes. You got right one there. leg, it goes right here. Looked like at one time it might have been a loggerhead turtle because there's a little piece of right there, but just a little old growth. Either that or uh, there's no back leg on him. When you're killing one legged ducks, <laughs> when you get out of one legged ducks, that means time's real hard. What happened there is uh, he got to flying in behind one of them mosquito trucks, them DDT trucks. And it got into his, his parents and grandparents and that DDT, that's the reason we used to follow that truck, you know, when, they, when the fogger would come through, we'd run right behind DDT trucks playing in the fog. And now, you know, buddy, you know, <laughs> that's what, <laughs> that DDT, man, it'll make you act funny when you get old. I don't know where to start. <laughs> yeah, Jay said, I can't believe they ain't seeing us. Maybe it's so many back, people. Said, Man, they just gonna... think that's way too many people <laughs> there, to be people. Yeah, they're, they're, those got to be them bird watches. There's no way they're that's hunters. A small village. <laughs> <laughs> those two bunches right there is all I needed on this particular day to make me extremely happy. All right, well, Willie. Hey. How you doing, sir? Tim? Who you got with you, Will? This is Brad. How you doing, sir? Good to meet you. <laughs> yeah, Brad. How you doing? Brad's with well, us. And Phil, what's up? You've you sacri yes, you sacrificed mightily Brad for all of us, my man. Yeah. We thank you for that, you hear? Thank you, sir. Mm. Thank you. Sir. I guarantee you. LaRoche? What's up? May your presence at the plate always strike fear in all the Golly. major league pitchers. I appreciate that. Did well, we're going to go down there and shoot some ducks Look this morning, good. you know. Did you see those pictures last I just hope night? I can hit one. Well, hey, what are you talking about? Just poke that gun out through the brush there and, you know, ground swat them on the water. Start with that. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have you care. We just want them to die, you know. <laughs>
I shot two and a half pocketfuls of rocks one time with a slingshot at a dove sitting on a high line. I shot both pocketfuls of fur and never hit him. I slipped off on my hand and knees, went back out to the gravel road and got me some more rocks. I eased back up there. I said, I will get him. I just kept lobbing him rock. He was sitting pretty good ways. He's over about 75 yards. Every once in a while, I was having to loop him, you know, because he's so far. I just, I was trying to gauge at that rock. I put him on all sides. Every once in a while, he'd flinch, you know, he'd look around. I finally got me a pretty big rock. Got me a good arc on it. Right in the head, he'd come off of there. I tore out of there. Got him! I'm gonna shoot this teal. Watch on your right. Watch on your right. Watch on your right. Maud whip us about three times a year because we got got into mockingbirds or cardinals. Mockingbirds and cardinals were out. Everything else was fair game. Sow and they kill the mockingbird. Get his tail whooped for that. But Sow was a good bird on it because he ate everything he killed. All the birds we eat. Oh, Brown Thrasher was his favorite. White meat. Si, I tell you, the boy of that is a pretty good green wing there. I was proud of him and there would be a buck deer. Good retrieve there, Si. A lot better than a dog. You trying to take the dog's job from her? Huh? You trying to take the dog's job? No. <laughs> We were going to get chow. Um, it was right at lunchtime. We were following the uh, the Bradley in front of us. I was talking on the hand mic on the radio to my section sergeant, and then next thing I know, I woke up in San Antonio. Yeah. So, a little over two years and 15 broken bones and a bunch of burns and a hand cut off later, here I am with the duck men and the duck commander, so not, not too bad. Yeah. Oh, we're glad you're here. You sure are. What are you? Ah, 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 the camera will call. No, the camera will call. to get ducks like that like 200 yards and they just come up and just... <laughs> they thought we were ducks. They thought we were ducks and they would never pull that. There were three pintails at 20 yards, son. Hey, I knocked one down at 60 yards. Why are you hollering? One down. Why are you hollering? You keep, point, you keep pointing right in front of you. If they was 15 yards uh, doing this in front of you, you should have killed all three of them. You and Stone. And they just swung past that tree right there. Idiot. And all them and I knocked one down Idiot. and I shot at him up in the middle. Idiot. <laughs> no. 
Bad call. Bad call. Bad call? Yeah, it's a bad call. Yeah, I made a bad call on them four gadwalls the other day. You just made a bad call on yep. 40. Hit them. That's just dumb. But the past before was close to that. You boys are always talking smack about my shooting. Right. I just saw it. It was terrible. I've been killing a whole bunch of them. They were in front of y'all. I'm not going to take the blame. You in this duck blind, if they're 20 yards from me, they're 20 yards from you. They were? Well, I ain't taking the blame, Jack. <laughs> Yo, know, so you can get off of that horse. He's dead. Fast as you can swing that gun. She got it. That's he. That's pretty good. We put a pretty good whipping on this. Yeah. Y'all gonna gripe about that? Killer. Killer. Hey, we saw that up off the water. Well, there comes Willie. Here he comes. How's that P Row paddling out there? <laughs> Willie, that P Row's for hauling. That ain't for getting in. <laughs> I'll see it all now, Will. Uh. I didn't know you could ride in that thing. I never would have thought he could do that. <laughs> I didn't, even think, think, I didn't even think he could ride in that. I thought he was sitting kind of low. That is a pee over there now. <laughs> you tried that? Did my pe did I was the just pellets? Driving tree to tree, pulling through. Did I sprinkle you all ago? Oh, man. You I almost lost it then with them shells. Yeah, it was just. That's one of the hardest ways I ever heard of to get to this duck off. Hey. I pulled it down the road half a mile. Yeah, I would have never attempted that. Nah. Boys, huh. it's been a journey. Well, get in here and kill your duck. Now, don't try that maneuver again, although it was a, but that was, the thing it was a, an accomplishment worthy of note. Well, that's a swan. No, he's just right here, Faye. He, he's working us. Yeah, look, he's working us. I don't know what it's saying. I don't know. He seemed to be responding to the call. I can't. <coughs> I thought you were going to come in here. Hunting Western Senior is on the premises. Oh, no. Come on, Alright, come over here, little girl. This is the Country and Western Senior here. 
we got a officially make you a a duck girl. Write us a song about just what you see and what you hear about <coughs> about duck hunting. You know, I was down there, you know, when the ducks was dying, and you know, and I got to crying. See, see what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 Old sign was no. Right, then we put them in the pan. We're frying. Times are hard. I ate too much lard. <laughs> uh, something. I'm trying to come up with some kind of riff. I'm okay. That duck was close. Right, he was about 15 feet. He was about 15 feet. So I, I got a question for you. Why didn't you shoot the drake? Hey, I just got on the first duck closest to me. Why didn't you shoot the other? Because <clears throat> he made a maneuver like you ain't never seen lately. <laughs> What's What's that? That? Come, come. Watch that. <laughs> Don't get a boat? Yeah. I think I shot two on the shot. No, you didn't shoot two on the shot. Good shot, Jason. Jason, how come you ain't shooting? She said all she's got to do is raise up and point a gun and they just fold. <laughs> she said, she looked at the thing like that and said, did I pull the trigger on that or not? <laughs> Want me to shoot him? James, where's him on the top? Ted went through that loop right there. See? Put all them ducks in strap. Put two here, two here, three here, three here. See what I'm saying? This gives you something to do for sure. You're the youngest one, see? <laughs> You break them down, I'll finish them off. I know she got to keep the thing in the last. Oh, she's got a little rim around. He's ring around his neck. And he's the only one, he got a white on his bill right there. They got, they got some other ones that ain't got that white right there. They, their bill is a little blue. We call them blue bill. Let me see, watch this. Put his eye back in. Rack <laughs> <laughs> him.
they gonna come in there like that, they're gonna be in trouble. <laughs> That's gonna be all if they do that. Carter, what do you think about that? Bro? I need I need to break this limb. Huh? Or something got I couldn't shoot. I'm, my gun got stuck, so I need to well, look, just pop shoot a limb. It, shoot, get, yeah, it'll go we'll right through. I think old Carter and the old duck man here teamed up on him. Yeah. I think it's a pretty good team, don't you, Carter? Mm-hmm. I'm sitting there eating peanuts. I looked up and I saw orange feet. Hey, Carter, did you stop eating them? I He's like, dead, dead. We ain't gonna kill anything with that going on.
Look at this. And they wonder why we do it. This little speech to be doing about 50 miles, 60 miles an hour when we run up on him. Well, look at him now. down there where we're hunting but you say but we're not seeing them nope they're operating now in stealth mode they are slick and the almighty made a duck I mean he made he is now a super duck Yeah. Well, you better make a move, cause I don't believe this is this is a flight day. Yeah, I'm thinking go over. All right. Use all means necessary to obtain all waterfowl. Over and out. That's the first time I've ever heard him say exactly what he had. He has a problem. He can't tell you what he has, and he can't tell you how to get somewhere. He said, how do you get there? He said, well, right there's some hills and a bottom. You go around the curve. That was just the name of the road. There, it looked like that place we were at that time. <laughs> I mean, it's a condition. I asked Governor, I said, where's that ice chest? He said, I was standing in the house. I said, where's the ice chest? He said, he said, down there on the left. <laughs> down I there said, on the left. Down there on the left. <laughs> That's All what I'm talking about. Door at the house. I followed his instructions. I went out there. Easy now. Watch him too. I walked outside the door and I thought, I said, 
So I look to the left, you know, I'm looking at the entire yard landscape yeah. on the left. So I walked out there and I turned left. I walked around out there on the left side of the yard. I walked around and around out there. I said, ha! I said, then I got the thing. I said, what kind of instruction was that? Willie. Does it go back on? There you go. You got longs? Man. Hey, let me put them with yours. <laughs> Dang. That wasn't too bad. Here, I'll just sit down. Does that go back on? Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right, there we go. I'm one of the most in-shape bearded rednecks in the world. Wow. And it's all natural. I guarantee you I can make a video, work out the natural way, and just do what I do, and people would buy it. <laughs> <laughs> my decoy string works my biceps and my tries, and uh, <laughs> then I get my jaw, you know, through the water. That works all the muscles and, and my cardio and uh, I work my abs every time I fall down I have to get back up so my six pack is looking nice <laughs> uh, my legs are like two pieces of gristle from running walking and running every day I'm rounding into shape. Seriously. They unloaded one of the 22s and I think it held 13 or 14 bullets. Did they put any holes in the fake deer? Oh, they had holes all in it. <laughs> that was one of the tickets, destruction of private property. Was it a buck? Yeah, I think it was a little old head, little three or four points on it. But they had him rigged up where he could move his head? Yeah. It, it, it's, if you look at it just right, you can see where his head was just swinging on his neck. Yeah. You know, you can see the line where his neck was connected to it, you know. <laughs> I said, man. But they started so shooting. So what happened once they started shooting? I don't know anything I need to do. <laughs> Take off. <laughs> they caught Did me. you see any blue lights? Bunches of them. <laughs> <laughs> Well, when you saw the blue lights, did it ever occur to you, you might all just stay put, and, or you figured you just what? It didn't really hit me right then, but when about a mile or so down the road when they caught me, run me off the road and stuck a pistol up my nose, I figured it was time to stop then. <laughs> so they got you stopped, and then that's when it started. How long did it, how, how, how much, how, what kind of, what kind of, what do they charge for a stunt like that <laughs> these days? I don't know what the total was, but you can figure $35 a month for about eight years. <laughs> That's what I paid them. <laughs> $35 a month for eight years. It was either that or go spend some time back up there in one of them little sales. Yeah. And they wasn't through with us either. They caught some boys, Rainer boys, the ones that did you dirt down here. Yeah. They caught them on the same deer. Kind of beat it in the head with a tire tool. Come and test suck it to a full dive. We didn't say 14 times. Did them this may not be a real deer when you hit it with a tire? I guess not. I don't know. You hear a sound like sparks flying. Them boys wasn't too bright anyway. Well, the young were a lot smarter than they were. Hey, we just shoot and run, but uh, <laughs> what did they what did say? I tried to hit it with a tire too. Once they got you stopped, what did they say to you? They said, "What are y'all doing?" I don't remember what all they said, but they sure wasn't happy about me. <laughs> <laughs> they're tired too, Did they handcuff you and all that? No. Uh, when they all got up here, about six or seven of them, and they wanted pulled out in front of me. And that's the only way it stopped because I went to hit the ditch going to go around him and I got stuck. So. 
Couldn't they get wouldn't pull Ryan. me out of the ditch when we left. They wouldn't pull you out? No, they called somebody to come pull me out of the ditch. Everybody's gone. I got a handful of tickets. And I walked <laughs> by and somebody come get me out of the ditch. Of course, it's a good night. Red, it was just a bad night. Wasn't it? About the last of December. I think it may have been January. Old Peggy Sue tore out right through the brush. Old Jason Peggy Sue went out there and mounted Drake. I heard her moaning out there in the brush. She went from grease lightning, Miss J. Blue lightning, to stop. All over. One retrieve. Got her. Well, this is the new one right here. Her name is Tracy. <laughs>